Hi friends, welcome. We'll try to create password protected PDF files by using Report Lab. So yeah, earlier we have seen how to create uh, PDF files by using various data sources and all. We have seen that and we have also used the images and created the PDF files. Now we'll use those files and uh, add password to it. So user has to enter the password to open the file and read the content. But here we'll use a very simple one. So one file we'll create and uh, then we will protect by a one password. So subsequently we will learn how multiple files with multiple different passwords. So there is not common password. Each individual will have its own password. Say like you are using your bank statement where you your first name or your date of birth or your uh, address quarter number something you have to use to uh, which is exclusively for your statement has to be used to open the uh, file so that what you learn in the second part let's start the script but before that my request is please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so you'll be notified as and when we are adding tutorials and we are frequently doing that also let's start the script we are in our local system using visual studio code so report lab we will use first we will import it from report lab PDF gen will use import canvas. So this will be using it. Now first let's create a file. So it's a simple file so that we can test it. Now I'm just pasting the path here. So this is the my drive directory, subdirectory and the file name. In your case, you can just change this one. So now let's create the canvas C equal to canvas dot canvas we are creating it first giving my path my path is what you have above we have given the uh, our file path we have given so that we are using it bottom up so you will be using uh, zero so from the bottom we are starting it so y coordinate will be zero at the bottom so and it increases as we move up so let's just create it c dot draw string we will adding a string only here location is 200 by 200 x and y so horizontally from the left edge 200 and from the bottom it is 200 again now we are saying a string only hello world you can write anything whatever you want let's create the page and save it also c dot so page now fine now save it c dot save so our canvas we have saved now everything is ready our file will be created let me just save it once running it so there is no error so file is created let's go and see how the file is it's a simple file so let's just go there here you can see my pdf this file is created hello world is there so this is the file now we'll add our encryption to this to add password, we'll import one more module. So for from report lab, li believe library import PDF encrypt. So this is now module is available. We'll create an object now. So for that, I'm just giving a name PW or you can give any name to this PDF encrypt dot standard encryption. Now here I will give the password. I'm giving a password as test you can do anything add any string here now this is where this particular text whatever we are writing it when you create in the next part the multiple pages will change this string so we will use the first name the date of birth combination of that whatever way you want so each file will have its unique password so now we are using a one file we are creating just to learn so we are using the uh, text net uh, test we are creating so this test will use it so for that let's just create it again so here we'll write encrypt equal to pw that's also we have while here when we are creating we have added this option encrypt is equal pw and this is where this we have created now let me just save this run once uh, okay okay I have not closed the previous file so I have to close it I'll just closing this okay now let me run this fine no error so let me just take you to the okay here it is my PDF now it is asking me for the password now I'm giving test 
okay let me open this yeah it has opened now let me just close this and again open it and this time i will give a wrong password so i am giving a wrong password okay it will not allow me the password is incorrect or lapse retry so i am giving now i am giving test okay so this is how it will work that's all friends hope you have a good uh, learning experience and we'll extend this part to in the part 2 we'll see how multiple files we will create and each file will have its own password so there is no common password so it will be a for my say my statement i it will be my first name or my combination number of five my first name and my uh, birth month or something else also you can create it so multiple files can will have multiple its own passwords uh, based on a certain parameters we will use it so that we'll learn in part two so if you have any doubts, suggestions or questions, use the comment section below to post it. And my request is please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so you'll be notified as and when we are adding tutorials and we are frequently doing that also. Please share this with your friends and thank you for watching.